Hello guys and welcome back to Ori and the Blind Forest where we can now swim and we have a lot of places to go to uh, but we also yeah right I was gonna say let, let's just go to the safe point which is here but yeah first we need to actually swim and get through this area <laughs> Is there actually something up here? Can we trap... Get him to be falling in here? No, oh, he doesn't want to go here. That seems like a secret area. Oh, I need to turn down my sound a little bit. That was a little bit painful. <laughs> okay, right. So we need a stomp, which we don't have yet. Is it at least uncovered? Well, kinda. Oh, okay. Um. I don't think he wants to really go through there. Now keep going here. Nah, the attacks don't actually bother him. Doesn't seem like he ever does it, honestly. At least as, as far as I can see, or do. Is there... oh yeah, we can move faster, that's right. Okay. So, underwater secrets, huh? Yeah, this whole... Well, that was one secret. Okay, let's get going now. Let's stop dying. <laughs> but yeah, this is so reminding me of Aquaria. Which is only fantastic. Let's take it nice and slow here. Because I'm not in a hurry. Not in a rush. Because I can just breathe. I'm still gonna rush, probably, just because, yeah. Okay. Well, that's an easy one. Of course, we still get hit. Let's save. Gives us some health back. But I'm really just amazed with how fun the makers of this game just have... Ooh, that was kind of close. Uh, how fun it is just to explore. Like, I can't say it enough, honestly. I'm also just going to go up here first for the map marker, so I don't forget. I'm sure we'll be going back there, but... And we're healed. And we're halfway there. Okay, so we do have this entire section filled out now. So I'm kind of guess. Ooh. I'm kind of guessing that at some point here, once we get access to this door, we're gonna get the stomp. 
because it just seems like yeah you get the ability so you can get the here you can get there and you can then get here and then you progress through here probably is what I'm guessing but let's see oh come on you stupid stupid thing it does seem a little bit silly to have an enemy at a map marker but of course he can charge that far. Why wouldn't he? Okay, so let's actually go through this bit, I think. And then we probably want to get... Well, let's actually go down first. Just so, you know, we've done that. But yeah, somehow it's just so much fun and it's always exciting just to, yeah, keep moving around the world, honestly. Uh, just most games, you get bored of it. Or not most. Well, probably most, but uh, the games that I've been playing. <laughs> Let's put it like that. Uh, ah, okay, I see now what they wanted to do not quite what my brain was thinking apparently but because that is a tough jump and then we get the water in there I think we save here just in case see but like little things like that it's just fun it's honestly is fun see and now because there was water here before because we done we've done this now when we assuming we get the stomp ability uh we will also be able to go down here because now we can stomp assuming that doesn't go through water all right so let's see also if I'm right in any sort of way. Also, does this, this... No, okay, that's nothing. Just seemed like you might be able to go through there, but... Apparently not. Also, these piranhas could not be... Uh, less threatening. They couldn't do it if they tried. where we want to go. I guess we just want to go up. Oh, uh, damn. Totally forgot about that ability. Okay, so... up that way I guess so that's really how you're supposed to do that but Ilo is the stoutest of all the spirits the most powerful I've ever seen now here he rests turned into an ancestral tree so stomp right <laughs> You learn Stomp. To use this ability, press space to leap into the air, then S to dive powerfully towards the ground. Okay, that seems that seems nice and easy. Of course, they give you the examples right away. Hmm. 
Where do we go up there, though? Ah, that's how, I guess. Wait, no. No, no idea. <laughs> Find a Goomon seal hidden inside the misty woods. Why is that my objective? Oh yeah, right, it is. That's kind of far. <laughs> kind of really far. Okay, well, let's just... We can't just break that? Do it from a certain height. Am I supposed to stomp this one in? Yes, okay. Sure. So, switches now. What's up there? Cool, I can damage those. This will save just in case. Let's get the thing in the water. Oh, stupid fish. I said no. Oh, the immediately going down is... <laughs> it's gonna be funny because I, I think I press down a lot more than I'm supposed to. <laughs> so imagine... Yeah, a lot of... I foresee a lot of stomping in my future. Uh, okay, so we can just do this. And let's level up. Okay, so. Uh, half the cost of a soul link. We can get that. Or ultra bash. We have bash. Oh yeah, of course. That's the, the redirecting thing. Which somehow it's a weird name for that ability. But uh, sure. Um, what should we be going for? Not that we can get this ability yet. Either of them. Um, or any of them. But I guess still the triple jump. Because, yeah, the damage wise does seem kind of nice. But considering we have stomp and we have all the movement ability, I think we're fine. Th those are words that I'm going to regret later, of course. But... Yeah, those are super easy to deal with now. <laughs> I guess we also go up here. Let's go like this. An ability cell. Oh, cool. Also seems like you're able to get that one on both ways. Saving, I guess. Uh, half the cost of a soul link. Yeah, sure. Let's just. We're just going that direction. Ah, well. And that's that. only get out because we have that ability yeah that seems to do a lot of damage uh, I'm just gonna be continually looking wait I broke that huh I was looking at that I it somehow it looked like it would be a secret area Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, 
uh, let's save here. And let's see if we can get the experience up here. No, you need to be... Hmm. Okay. So that was fun to get. Let's see how much damage this really does. I... Yeah, considering the damage we're doing, that's actually our strongest attack as well. Uh, okay, so I just don't know how to get to this one yet, but uh, that's fine. So the question is now, do we just go down and get a bunch of stuff here? Seemingly, we can just do that. Like the stuff here and here and... Should we? Should we just go down? I think so. Ah, uh, those enemies are giving four experience now. This is huge. They still hit me though, but. Uh, yeah, let's just save. So everybody likes that. Uh, okay, so I guess I just go down and go into here and do this jumpy around bit, because I didn't do that once I got the double jump. Yeah, like going through these areas does make me kind of want to go uh, it would be nice to have stronger attack I guess mm, let's see yeah it would be here already I guess we're supposed to go down anyway It's just funny how bad I am at dodging those. But at least we also get an additional life. It's worthwhile. Hence it's worth saving. Uh, so that's that. Then there's this little alcove here. And then I guess we should go here and then down. <laughs> Another ability cell. It does seem like it really does reward just going back and getting some pickups. Okay. Why would I... I don't know why I did that, but I guess saving is good. <laughs> I don't recall this place. <laughs> A little bit more experience, it's fine. I don't know what was up there. Don't really... Ah, I do remember this, yeah. Don't really remember. Oh yeah, the side where it did that jumping. Yeah, okay, gotcha. That's why I saved. But I'm not sure why I did that. God, am I not paying attention? Sorry, I was watching the experience bar, see if it actually lowered. Come on. This shouldn't be this difficult. 